Hi, this is Andreas Suchuk. In this video episode, I would like to talk about page name and page URL in Adobe Analytics. Basically, the conversation is why you shouldn't store page URL instead of the page name. I continue my audit of Adobe Analytics implementation on American Airlines and I'm going to show you what I have discovered. I am on the US homepage and as we can see, the page name is populated with the value home. Now I'm going to switch to another page and I will go to travel information and click lounges. And as you see, the page name is now populated with the page URL or a part of the page URL. And this is not a good practice at all. Basically, the result of that is that in the page name report, now there is a mix of page names and page URLs. So never do that. Now, if we switch to another site, for example, it will be Germany. We can again see that instead of the page name, like in this case it should be home, we have again the page URL. This is one of the worst practices. My advice for you is first, before doing the implementation, you should have page naming convention developed. If you want to know more about that, I have recorded a few videos dedicated to naming convention, to naming convention for page names. You can find them on this channel. Once the page naming convention is ready and you are doing the, the implementation, make sure to test every page on every site. And if you have, instead of the page name, page URL or any other value or the value doesn't exist, you should fix it before going live. Otherwise, it will be very complicated for your analyst managers, those who will be working with Adobe Analytics, to work effectively with the page name report. If you have any comments, if you want to share your best practices, leave them in the comments and subscribe to my channel and click on the bell icon to not miss new video uploads and Thank you for watching.